Rafael Nadal made a winning return to competition at the Barcelona Open. Rafael Nadal made his long-awaited return to the clay courts at the Barcelona Open on Tuesday, 681 days after his last match on his favorite surface. The tournament's 12-time champion stepped out onto the appropriately named Pista Rafa Nadal court, beating Flavio Kobli 6-2 6-3. As well as being his first clay match since winning a 14th French Open title on Junt 5, 2022, it was also his first official match since January. After months of uncertainty, Nadal's outing in Barcelona provided plenty of insight into where his game and body are at. As he hopes to return to the French Open next month, the Spaniard's victory over Kobli taught fans five things about his condition and his next match against world number 11 Alex de Minor will be an even better indicator of Nadal's level. Nadal pulled out of last week's Monte Carlo Masters after admitting that his body wasn't ready to compete. By all accounts, the 37-year-old looked fine in training apart from one crucial shot, the serve. Nadal himself had explained that abdominal issues were affecting the shot and he was seen using an abbreviated motion in practice. Despite his dominant win over the world no. 62, it was an obvious weak point, especially in the early games. Nadal put his serve in the net on the opening point of the match and, on the second point, hit a double fault. He served three overall and also failed to produce any aces. He still managed to win 69% of service points but the shot can and will be exposed by top players. Nadal's locker room aura is one of the greatest on tour. With 22 Grand Slam titles to his name, no one wants to play him even in what is just his second tournament in the last 16 months. And that's especially true on the clay. Nadal is known as the king of the surface and boasts 14 French Open crowns and 12 trophies in Barcelona. There is also no greater aura than competing on a court named after you, as Nadal did against Kobli on Tuesday. And, it was clear that the Spaniard's reputation played a part in the result as the Italian made some costly mistakes, ending the match on 41 unforced errors.